undefeated Clemson, ranked number three in the playoff chase, and number 12, Florida State. Before signing day. Watson down the middle. Leggett running free. Jordan Leggett gets a block, heads for the corner, and be driven out inside the five. And the Tigers threatening on their opening possession. Goleman barrels ahead and breaks the plane. And Clemson takes the opening kickoff and marches 68 yards for the early lead. Third and 13 now. Humphrey. And he's dropped again as the pass rush gets after Francois. Cleland Farrell with his fourth sack of the season. The Knolls go backwards. Watson fires low but complete. Williams goes down low and beats McFadden and they move the sticks again. On first and goal, Watson lofts it to Renfro for a touchdown. Two drives, two scores. Derwin James can only watch helplessly from the sidelines, hoping his guys can get a stop. But Watson throws, and it's picked off. Picked off by Marquez White. And that experienced guy, Kirk, you just referred to a much-needed takeaway for this Florida State defense. Watch him at the top here. He actually baits him to make it look like he's taking this receiver, but then at the last second, he drops. I think he fooled Deshaun Watson completely. He thought he'd be in the flat. He thought he had an open receiver, but he baits it. See, my bad there, he got me. He got me on that one. See that late movement right here. They come after Francois. Nyquan Murray makes a play, and Murray running free. Finally making an impact. Number 80. Hadn't had a reception since mid-September. Four games without a catch, but we thought he might make an impact tonight. Second and three after all that excitement. Cook's got it again, holds on to it, and barrels in for a touchdown. Dalvin dodges a turnover and then reaches the end zone. What a two-play sequence, and the Noles back in it. After playing with a sore shoulder the last game, now a long drop back. Looking for Tate downfield, lops it up, and it's intercepted. Jadar Johnson's got it for the Tigers. And he will just fall down across the 30. It was 18 versus 18. And by the way, Christian Wilkins lowered the boom on Francois as he got that ball away. Absolutely. Nobody picks up Christian Wilkins, and he's just going to hit him right there, coming down with 310 pounds. But how about the range again of Jadar Johnson? Boom, that's a big hit from Wilkins. But look at Johnson. He has such range to be able to close ground and go up and make a play. and Convert the chip shot field goal through those old school double goal posts here at Doak Campbell Stadium, which you have to love, right? You don't see those too many places. Throws downfield, looking for Murray, who makes the catch. Move the chains, Knowles with those two timeouts as Francois fires to the end zone. Incomplete. After further review, the receiver maintained possession. Touchdown. Here's a downfield shot. And it's caught by Kane, who just ran right past Marcus Lewis. And the Tigers are down threatening again. From 34 for a six-point lead. No problem. And second down. Watson throws a pick. Once again, it's Tavares McFadden, the nation's leader in interceptions. He's got his sixth pick of the season. And the Seminoles are in business in plus territory. Second pick for Watson tonight. First down. Cook bounces it, gets the edge. Dalvin Cook down the sidelines, headed for the end zone. Touchdown, Seminoles. Cook gets the edge. Dalvin Cook off and running again. They will not catch him. Touchdown number two for Cook. Watch, watch how quickly he gets to the corner right there. And now he beats 23 in white. Van Smith to, the, to that edge. And in grand style, Kirk, Dalvin, as he hits the tape there at the finish line. 
sets the Tigers up at first and goal. Gallman tried to lead in second effort. Spotted short. See, it After like a further touchdown. review, the player broke the goal line. Touchdown. And he beat him again. And Cook gets the edge again. Gets a block. Dalvin Cook romping through the secondary again inside the 35. Number four can't be stopped right now. Yeah, this is this is Austin Bryant. There's a flag. Oh, they're going to bring this. It may bring this one all the way back. Personal foul. Lock below the waist. Offense number 23. 15 Ouch. That's, that's the fullback, Freddie Stevenson. Yeah, who knows? Third and 21. Watson buys time. Delivers low. Catch made, not a first down, but Renfro scooped it off the turf. After further review, the ruling on the field stands. Fourth down. Nothing to show that ball hit the ground. They are going for it. Two defensive linemen, the jumbo formation. They run Gallman behind it, and he escapes, and Gallman galloping down near the 30, much more than what he needed for the lead. That is a pressure field goal. Hammers it right through. Again, you want to try to finish the job if you can. Stevenson, the fullback, running left, has a gap. Stevenson gets the edge. Dives down inside the five. Cook. Scores, standing up. Knowles reclaimed the lead. Here's the two-point play. Francois, some confusion there. Rudolph was at a tough night. Only one catch. He wasn't turned around. From the pocket. Leggett streaking free already with one play. They are at midfield. And Deshaun fires to a wide open man. A complete bust. And Leggett dives to the pylon. Touchdown, Clemson. It's a busting coverage. Two defenders go deep. The freshman Myers and A.J. Westbrook. They went with one of the receivers, Hunter Renfro, downfield. Two defenders go deep. Nobody picks up Jordan Leggett. You look at the well, that's acrobatic a, move by a tight end, folks. The left hand to keep him elevated before he hits and tries to get the ball extended for the goal line. But two plays to make 10 more yards, and Francois Firing far side, catch made, Rudolph, they beat Tankersley, they move the sticks. I did, instead of trying to get the first down, remember that left side. Pressured immediately, Francois is going to be swarmed under, cannot take that sack. They've got to get all the way down to the Clemson 24 to stay alive. Immediately pressured again, Bullwear will end the Seminoles' chances and secure a Clemson victory with the sixth sack tonight for this defense. Tigers are going to escape Tallahassee with a W. Clemson for just the second time in the last 13 visits to Tallahassee comes out on top in the first time since 2006.